But racing isn't the only thing on the schedule today in Marshalltown. The Dirt Knights teams have joined forces with a local group called Carson's Crusaders for a special event called Dirt Madness to raise cancer awareness and support the fight of six-year-old Carson Miller, who was diagnosed with leukemia at the age of three. We wrote a song here about racing life, both on the fan side and on the field. I'm kicking Kansas butt. This is a song called Speed. One night we were sitting in the stands and Carson was in the middle of treatment and we were thinking about what we needed to do to create awareness and help others because it had been such a difficult path that year. We said, you know what, I think we could raise a few dollars by selling some t-shirts. And within about three months, we had raised about $24,000 and um, donated all the money to organizations that help others affected by cancer. We just had person after person after person come in and tell us their story, you know, and whether whether the person was 65 years old or, you know, they lost their spouse or their sibling or whatever, you know, it just, it just gives you goosebumps. I'm getting them now. It was pretty amazing last year uh, what happened that one week, but even over the course of the three months to sell 1,200 t-shirts in three months, you know, we thought maybe we'd sell a couple hundred and that would be it. Uh, we didn't do any advertising or anything like that. People just started talking about it and uh, it grew from there. When we unveiled this idea, if you want to call it that, we knew that there were so many people out there who cared, but it was just overwhelming. We, as a racing community, are a racing family. One lap at a time, we're going to kick cancer's butt. Thank you, y'all. Very few know how to pull together like the close-knit family of short track racers around the country. When one of their own needs help, they step up to the plate full throttle. And today's event is a great example.